Ooh. Varkin again! No! I'm scared of the guy. Why do I have to fight against Varkin all the time? Shit! Oh, it's the centrifuge centurion strategy. Alright. Well, I'll be damned. Drone. How do I build a centrifuge? Because <laughs> that's what I need to build. I think that's the superior strat. I'm not sure. Although, if he harasses me with grenade mechs fast enough, maybe it's not the superior strat. Hard to say. Hard to say. Drone. So I believe next turn I will get a centrifuge, but I need an engineer for that as well. Now Varkin's not salty. He's he's a cool guy. I like him. He gets two blast forges straight off the bat. He's rushing for grenade max. Crap. Oh, I think I'm just gonna die before I get my centurion. I do believe I'm gonna die before I get my centurion. Oh, uh, I mean centrifuge. I would need to survive too many turns. I can't do it. Drone. Oh. If, if I get a centrifuge now, he will get a grenade mech. Shit, I'm, I die. I lose. He gets a grenade mech. He gets four attack, kills my engineers and the drone. And then I will have to build a Blast Forge and uh, still take a hit. I can't go for the Centrifuge anymore. He just owned my strategy. I, I will have to go Xeno Guardian. It's true. Shit. And is he even prompt? He's not even prompt. So I'm still gonna get my ass kicked. Unless I go Xeno Guardian wall or something. Oh, now he's not going for it, because he saw that I strayed from the build order. He forced me to play safer, and now he's playing safer himself, it seems. Drone. Drone. Alright, now let's drop the centrifuge. And he's teching like crazy. I mean, I'm gonna get the centurion from the centrifuge. He's gonna have all the tech paths available to him with uh, normal teching. Which makes me surprised that he built all of this. No. No, of course he's gonna go for Grenade Max. Yeah, no Animus. That would be silly. That would be silly as hell. Of course you're gonna just rush me down. Drone. W. Now, I can lose some of my Engineers. This will be a very fast and aggressive game. In which too many drones may not be need to be built. Delta. He says as he builds a drone. Actually, a Venge Cannon is here as well. Delta. How about that? How about that? Do I need a second forge? I would like some grenade mechs myself. They are, I think, by far the superior attacking force in this game. Bravo. Let's get a second forge. Space. Space. And I'll have to lose my entire engineers. Entire three engineers if he attacks with all of his stuff. No, I'm gonna lose two of my engineers. I could venge, but I don't think I would survive for a very long time. <laughs> I, I don't think a, verge, a venge cannon would work like this. If I wanted to venge cannon, I shouldn't have built the Blast Forge in the first place. I should have gone straight from the venge, probably. I'm not sure if my... I wouldn't have built the centrifuge if I wanted to Venge Cannon. It was, it's a build order that wouldn't work anymore, I'm not sure. Uh, now look at his drones. He's got, what, three more drones than me? Home. Space. He decides not to use his pixies yet. Drone. But he already forced me to build a wall, so that already sucks for me. Home. Now I'm gonna put some pressure on him. See how he deals with it, because he just opens up an animus, which means he has something in mind that he wants to build. Maybe and if I force him to build a wall, it will prevent him from building what he wants. Delta. Space. Space. And then he has to attack me now, otherwise I get a centurion and he will not attack me anytime soon. He actually gets his own centurion. He was able to afford it just like that. So my grenade mech will not really do anything against a centurion. Um, space. And uh, his attacks will also be kind of futile against mine. Um, drone. My centrifuge now pays off. Shit, maybe now it's time to just go massive Venge Cannon. Um, 
Just grenade back Venge, pretty much. Um, why the fuck not? Um. <laughs> yeah, that seems fun. <laughs> Let's just do this. Love it. Space. Space. Yeah, just do that. That's gonna be so much damage next turn, it's gonna be silly. I'm just gonna venge him to, to death. Now, obviously, I, I have no economy. No economy was owned by me since now. Save the drones, don't build bench cannons. <laughs> Sorry, Varkin. It's happening. It is. Orders from upstairs. It's gonna be a gigantic burst once it all launches. I believe I will still be able to afford a grenade mech next turn. So I'll stockpile even more damage. Oh, he ventures too. Of course he does. Of course he does. It's the only offensive unit he can afford, because it costs only 3 gold, he has to build a lot of walls. <laughs> oh, space. Mouse. Now, he does have enough defense, he would lose everything except the Centurion. Mouse. So it's not worth it. Drone. Now, I do need conduits, a crap ton of conduits. I do. Oh. If I want to go Venge. Oh. What? How do I do this, though? Because I could go Venge again. And then a drone. And then I would have, what, uh, six drones. Six income every turn. Home. 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 Instead of the conduits, I could make grenade mags. And then, how much attack do I want? Because eight, he just loses a wall. Mouse. Ten, I believe he uses two engineers. Wall and Centurion. I believe here he would lose uh, Engineer Engineer. Wall and one Centurion. I think this is exactly how much attack I need. No, I need one more. And then I will wipe everything except for the Centurion, saving the maximum amount of pixies in my hand. I believe that's the most efficient thing I can do. Wait, what? I was wrong! He saves Engineer and Doom Drone. But he does have to lose two walls, unless I miscalculated. So that's nice. Yeah. Yeah, it was okay. But I'm scared. He's got a bigger economy now. He also builds Venge Cannons. He doesn't have enough attack to do anything, so I guess I'm the one destroying shit. So maybe I am doing okay. I don't know. I, I do need more, more green. I do need more green. Home. Space. Drone. Home. Wait, what? Oh no, the bench cannon nerf! Now it costs four green! Oh no! The bench cannon nerf! Shit, I think I, I need the green. Without the green, I'm fucked! And with the green, I will be able to activate ghost charges every turn. And besides, I cannot attack, I cannot afford a grenade mech anyway. So now I have... Uh, how much do I want to attack for? <clears throat> I guess I want to keep my pixies for one explosive turn. Um, what if I did this? Um, no, I have to do this. Should I should have built the conduits earlier, I think, I don't know. I don't know any, any more about this game. Shit. He gets another grenade mag. Now he puts me on the defensive. He feels confident enough. He can afford it. Especially because of superior economy. Crap. Is this game turning around? I think it's turning around, guys. I think it's not working for me as well as I wanted it to.
those earlier Venge Cannons are not paying for themselves because I didn't have enough green for them. The build order was flawed in its design. Ah. Face. See, if I had more green, I would trigger this, and then the Venge Cannons would be worth it. Without it, they are not. Brown. Now with this, I get two more attack next turn. He actually breaches me if he wants to. Crap. I'd have to lose a drone for defense as well. This is so all-in, it's just ugly. It's so all-in. I can't do this! I can't do this! Why, why would I do this? This makes no sense. But next turn I would be able to trigger two Venge Cannons. I guess I could do, instead of this, I could go... One more money for the wall, shit. But... So with this, I'd be able to trigger one more Venge Cannon next turn with the Ghost Chargers. Shit, but it doesn't work properly. Oh. No, I need the wall for defense, otherwise I'm just gonna get breached myself. Oh. But then if I go Venge Cannon now, I don't have enough green next turn for... Ah, oh, this is shit, this is shit. This is shit either way. I don't think I win this. I have too many Ghost Cannons and not enough Conduits to fully support my Ghost Charge production. He's got double the drones I do, and he's starting to actually get solid attack now, so... All I will be able to do is build one wall per turn and then trigger my Venge Cannon every turn after this one. It's not enough, I don't believe this is enough. He already does have more defense than I have attack. But maybe one... Nah. Red. Life sucks. I think he's got me this time. I need to stop queuing up the same time as Varkin. He's too good of a player. There are so many weak players I could be playing against. Face. But instead, I get a freaking Varkin. Drone. W. Um. I don't actually need a wall right now. I just sack one engineer and then uh, block on the Centurion. So I do have time to build some attack or a conduit, actually. I think a conduit is the way to go. And then I still deal more damage with my Venge Cannons, so his economy might be balanced. His superior economy may be balanced by the fact that I deal more damage, right? Uh, he is rarely, if ever, able to build any attackers because of my continuous onslaught. I will have 16 attack next turn, potentially. Holy shit. That is quite something, isn't it? He will have to just build walls in panic. Oh, I think he's getting breached. Oh, am I doing it? Oh my god, am I doing it? Is my attack too much? I think I'm doing it. Maybe his m big mistake was making an Animus just so he could build the Centurion. And then he's not using this Animus for anything else until the end 